Hey guys, it's Bianca from Plan, Love, and Travel. How are you today? Today I have a sticker haul to show you guys. It is Monday, and how was your Monday? How do you guys like Monday? Do you like Monday, I should say, because I guess the dogs don't like Monday. They're voicing their opinions. <sighs> Mondays are, it depends. If I get enough sleep, I think, and I had a restful weekend and I'm ready for work, I'm fine with Mondays. If I don't, then I don't, I don't like Mondays. I just, I don't know. I mean, who wouldn't want to have like endless amount of money where you didn't have to work and just do what you wanted to do? Like plant and have stickers and just, you know, anyhow. One can dream, right? So the first order I have is from Simply Watercolor Co. This is actually more of an unboxing. This is the subscription, which now that I'm looking at it, I hope I paused it because we'll be moving and I don't have our new address just yet. I haven't decided if I'm gonna get a PO box or an actual, or use the mail that's provided, I guess. Anyhow, you guys didn't need to know that. So, let's get into it. It's so pretty. I saw this and I was like, oh my gosh, I love her stuff. So it looks like we have a washi, some washi, um, what is this, like a sample, I guess you can call it. I think all the background stuff, hopefully it focuses right. Do you guys see how the there's bows and stars and dots? It's all gold foil. That's what I'm trying. I'm moving it so you guys can see the gold foil. There you go. I'll just tilt it like this. And then you have this beautiful flowers that are like autumn color and they actually match obviously the kits so you have some of the pink the yellow and the orange I'll put that aside and oh my gosh this is why I love this look at this oh, it comes with foil overlays this one has miniature pumpkins on it so cute this one is and yes the and that I guess oh no that doesn't match what does this go over Maybe here? Maybe here. Anyways, I'm trying to see what letter that is or if it's just a squiggly design. Why can't I figure this out? I don't know. Anyways, maybe it's in, no, that's not an F for fall. I don't know. And it also comes with icons and it's in hollow. Ooh, well, that's pretty. It's so cute. Look at that, it's like, marshmallows for hot cocoa, carving pumpkins. I like this, that's so pretty. There's pumpkins around the planters and stuff, super cute. Next is we have some more, the foiled basics. Oh, you know what it looks like? I think it's like the gold hollow almost. You see how it's gold and then when I shift it a different way, it looks like a different color. Maybe it's not picking up, so I just sound crazy. I don't know if you guys see it, but it almost turns rose gold and then some other colors too, but it's mainly gold. So you have some day covers here, some, um, what are those half boxes, I guess? Some more icons, flags, and individual dots with the bows. Love the bows, love, 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 love. Okay, let me go over the foil real quick. I think this is based in I was gonna say basic because it says foil basics, but I think this is in all of the kits, I believe, and then she switches it up with the specialty stuff. That's how I'm gonna call it as. Uh, the link and everything you'll need to know about the subscription will be in the de subscription will be in the description box below. Whew. I thought I was gonna screw it up, but I actually said it right. So here we have some more of the gold foil. We have it in to do this week work and reminder. Or remember, remember, not reminder. I swear, work was fine. Mondays is fine, Mondays are great. Here you have more of the date covers. And this says weekend. You have some of the clear foiled headers, flags. Some miniature deco, and then it looks like a half box-ish. It's pretty large. And then you have the bottom washi, and then some regular bows. So you, so you see that shift in the color? That's why I was thinking maybe it was 
Oh, gold hollow. The dots are gonna be really hard to show, but you can see it in the bows. All right, so let's get into this kit. So pretty, so pretty, oh my gosh. Okay, I hope you guys can, I have it up higher so you can see the detail, so I might have to lower it to get more of the gold foil. But here it says, autumn leaves and pumpkin, please. And pumpkins, please, yeah. Here you have like a journal or a planner, coffee, you got some pumpkins and the flowers. You have the white pumpkins, which are actually my favorite. Whoa, with the gold foil bows on top of it. Here you have some more of that gold foil with the flowers, the and, and then you have the cozy socks with the, I'm assuming pumpkin spice coffee with a tray with pumpkins on it. Some more of the pumpkins or are those gores or what, what are they? What are those things called? You know how you decorate it? Aren't those gore? I don't know. Anyhow, another pumpkin with sweater, sweaters, sweater. <laughs> and I love this turquoise paint, um, pumpkin. Gosh, it's like I can't talk. And here you have a long washi strip. Next, here is the washi. Bottom washi and then the minute like the small top washi, which is super pretty. I love that mint color she's pulling into the kit. Super cute. So then you would use this over the pumpkins, I guess, because this the wash is cut kind of thick like the pumpkins. So pretty. Here you have date dots, and then you have some more of the quarter boxes. You have, oh, she gave you a choice, I guess. Here's some more washi for the bottom. This is like one long piece and then these two are divided. So I wonder, maybe you could use all three? I don't know. I'll have to try it and see. So pretty. Next is more of the functional page. So here you have your heart checklist, the weekly habit tracker. I don't know if you guys can see it. It does say Monday through Sunday on there. Then this is blank so this could be another full box some more um, boxes another box movie icon mini flags I like the mini flags because I do like to put them in my planner as I'm planning because my planner doesn't have like the main flag on top I think it's because that Erin Condren was colored I don't know it's only the flags in the neutral I don't know but now I think she changed it where I don't even think it has a flag anymore so I guess it doesn't matter, but I never had a flag on my Erin Condren. Here you have a habit tracker, some more circles and flags, colored deco, your wiki, wiki, weekend banner. Oh my gosh. The bigger flags, washi strip with the white pumpkin. And then here at the bottom, you have another longer washi strip with white bows. It's so pretty. I wish I could talk better. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. I just don't know. And here you have your um, headers, the dots again, and some of them, oh my gosh, the pumpkins. That is so cute. And the reef. You have the to-do, today, remember, appointment, work, some more functional deco, I guess, and just deco itself, but I like the clipboard with the pumpkin. More washi strips, more habit tracker, and then some more boxes that are Matching the kit, so, so pretty. And then my favorite page. I saved the best for last. Actually, I didn't, obviously, this is my first time opening it, but anywho, the best is for last. Look at all these boxes and the washi strips. I don't know, do you guys still call these washi strips even though they're the larger ones? I would like to know. Maybe they're still the quarter boxes, but, you know, really not. You know what I mean? They're not like faded. I don't care. I'll still use them. They're so pretty. You have some more deco. And then at the bottom, you have some more washi strips and then bill dues. And then, what does that say? To do? Yeah. The last part is to do with the ombre bow checklist. And then washi strips again on the bottom. So that is it for the kit. Again, you have one, two, three, four, five pages plus all this foil. Oh my gosh, it is so, so, so pretty. I'm in love with how she used all the white pumpkins. That's 
legitly my favorite. I think I like it because then you don't have to paint the pumpkin. I like doing either like Jack Sparrow or what else did I do? I did another one that just said boo on it and it was like bedazzled. It was really cute. So next I have an order from Style Planner and I'm so, so excited about this because of the August kit. And I'll tell you why, because you're like, probably if I uploaded the video, cause my, oh, my, my, my special computer. Anyways, I already have an August monthly. That's what I was trying to say. So the reason why I'm so excited is because it's for my happy planner. So yes, so stay tuned. I'm probably gonna try to do my monthly with it. I'm so excited. So here we have the freebie that came in. I love that. This piece, happy view. I get to use it today. Oh, I got a sunburn and I put on that, that aloe stuff with the lidocaine, the blue one, and I got my shirt stuck to myself. Ooh, I felt that. Okay, anyways, I know, personal, what is it, TMI? Yeah, there we go. Anywho, you looked at that freebie long enough. Next, I picked up Grey the Cat Hollow um, Vinyl, super cute. I had to get another one. I think I put them on my computer, and I had to get another one for my other binders and stuff, because he's adorable. Like, why wouldn't you have it? All right, so let's move this aside. Let's get into... The rest of the stickers, I know, I bought more stickers, I'm sorry. Here was Chinese food, look how cute that is. Oh my gosh, I love it. And then I got the breakfast one, so you have your eggs, toast, and bacon, your cereal breakfast date, which I love, because I love having breakfast dates. Breakfast is like my favorite food, or like time to eat, I guess, like your style of food, I guess I should say. I love breakfast. I could have breakfast food for dinner for sure. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys had breakfast for dinner. It's so good. Anyways, you have the coffee, pancakes or waffles. It looks like pancakes, but it could be waffles, whatever. And then your overnight oatmeal. Super cute. Next, of course, <laughs> I forgot how she labeled this on the site. So you have the Chinese takeout, then you have it on the plate, egg rolls, the wontons, and then again, which is super cute. Love, 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 love. All right, so for this kit, so this is what it comes with. I actually didn't pick up anything extra. Normally I pick up like the deco and stuff like that, but I already have, I think some left over from the first time I got it from my Erin Condor, and so it will be okay. So again, with this beautiful gold foil, you have your date dots, your functional icons, first day of school, summer adventure, and then your paydays, and you have two, you have a strawberry and a lime, or lemon. I guess it's a lime, those are all green. <laughs> Slices on there for deco. Then you have your August washi, so pretty, so, so, so pretty, oh my gosh. Then you have your washi strip right there. Then you have, oh, so it's broken up, that's really cool. So normally for the Erin Condren, this is all one sticker. These three things come out, they're stacked onto each other and it's one big sticker. I think this is, yeah, so this is one sticker here. And then you have one there, and then I have a bunch of labels you can use, bill dues with the hearts that are foiled, and then you have foiled deco right here that matches. You have Summer Adventure written on here, and then down at the bottom, you have this month overview, goals, projects, and next month. So yeah, I'm super excited. I'm actually gonna go ahead and sign. I don't think I'm gonna sign off, because I think I might have some more things coming in. So that is everything I got from the style planner. And that's it for today's haul. And we'll take it over for today another day. Today I have a haul to share with you guys. I'm so excited. I went to Michael's and then we went to Joann's and then I went to Target. So I am so, okay, let's just get into it because I'm gonna say I'm excited again and you already know. 
So I did pick up the extender metal disc and I got it in the rose gold. I think they're so, so, so pretty. And I love the rose gold. I'm just going to put it over there. Might as well start putting them away. Next, I did get this happy memory keeper. Keeping. I can read, I promise. So I'm going to do a flip through real quick, kind of, maybe. So we got the letters and numbers down at the bottom. Oh, whoa, okay. Calm down. Calm down. We have the months. Oh my gosh, okay. Obviously, not going to happen. Smaller months and then more dates. Posted notes. Ooh, those are pretty. Birthdays and anniversary celebrate. We got some cakes. I love this camera. This camera is so pretty. Can you guys actually see what I'm doing? I know I'm in like frame, but I don't know if you guys can actually see all the details. It says no school, fun day, relax, some more posted notes. Um, sticker day, yeah. It's a good day for a good day, donut day, ice cream day, Super Bowl, coffee day. Shut up, there's a unicorn day. Yes, happy planner, you just make me so happy. Ooh, these are in gold foiled, so, so pretty. Um, these are all the different types of holidays. Here we have some more colored holidays. The months again, you have date dots and it looks like these are, yep, themed. They're, what is it? Not themed, what is it called? Like holiday themed, I guess. We have some regular date dots or date dates. Ooh, very, very small ones. Ooh. And we have some more of the stickers. And more stickers. Fall bucket list. I like how it's fold, foiled. Gold foiled. I can talk, I swear. So that is the happy memory keeping. I got that because, you know, what's coming up. Just saying. So I did went ahead and bought this block pad. I didn't buy it the first time because I was like, Bianca, you don't need a block pad. And then I saw it and I'm just like, but it matches my note planner. Where is it? Do I have it buried somewhere? All the stuff that was on my desk is actually on my bed right now. And it looks like it's where I, I could have sworn I just had it. Here it is. And I was like, it's literally buried. But look at that. In the rainbow disc. So I actually turned this into, it was a happy notes, and I actually turned it into a sticker book, kind of, sort of. So I have the sticker dashboards in there, and then I think I have, yeah, more stickers. And then I have some of the notes back there that I was coloring in. But yeah, I saw this. It was perfect. It's so, it's just, uh, yeah, it fits my planner. So I had to get it. I do have the hole puncher, so if I wanted to, I could punch these in into my planners, but, and that's what it looks like. And I love it. Today is for tacos, naps, smiles, donuts, friends, and adventure. 100%. Love it. So, here is another planner. Oh my gosh. Okay, so, whew, let me, okay, I got this together. First of all, can we just appreciate the unicorn? Whoa, that was like more dramatic taking off than needed. But I thought the unicorn was so, so pretty because you know, I already have a unicorn, but you can't have too many unicorns. So the reason why I got this, there is a reason. So I wanted, okay. A, it started in July. I have yet to touch my happy planner because it starts in August and it makes me very, very sad. So, what I want to do is my student one because it has a different layout and I can show it to you. Ow. What did I stab my finger for? And on what? What did I stab my finger on? Here we go. We'll just we'll just be in October because why not? Okay, so as you can see, it's a different layout, okay? 
These are definitely narrower than these and I have sticker kits that I really, really want to use and incorporate into the Happy Planner. So what I was thinking of doing was in my student, excuse me, in my student one, I was going to plan out the week, right? And then save room where I can document what we did that week and what happened and blah, blah, blah and have my note paper and stuff like that. Here I wanted to do a memory plan or a memory spread, I guess. Like I wanted to plan this out after everything happened and used my pretty stickers to tell my week. So that's what this is for. This is for backtracking. So I'll fill, I'll use the student one for a week and then come on here and lay out my stickers for everything because I have a lot of stickers, you guys, and I don't want to like not use them. And I'm talking about like stickers for, and it's not just Happy Planner. I have a lot of stickers like, like these or the sticker sheets and stuff like that. So I really wanted to use them and I love this idea of creating my own planner and I'm super happy about it. So that's why I have this one, basically, is so I can memory plan with it and use up all of my stickers. And I can start now, which makes me super happy because I haven't done a spread yet. Anyways, so I guess I can show you guys what it looks like. So here we have Hello Sunshine, September, You Can Do Anything. October is a cat. Have a lovely day. November is gratitude. December are coffee mugs, which are super cute. January, throw kindness around like confetti. And it's gold. Has that foil gold in it. So pretty. February, looking all like... Valentine's Day, be happy for March. April, keep going. May, ooh, I love lemons. Oh, I love that. I love that so much, it's so pretty. June, there is beauty and simplicity. Be kind to yourself. August, focus on you, focus on happy. I love the dogs. September, I love this. That's really pretty too. You got your own happy planner going on. And then again, back to October, stay magical. You know, this is nice. It's not huge on holidays. That's what I wanna say, not seasons, but holidays. I kinda of like that because if you're not super, obviously if you're not religious or Christian, you probably wouldn't want, or if you didn't believe in Santa, you know what I'm trying to say? Like, if you didn't, if you weren't that type of person, I like how this is, like, neutral. You know, it's not going with it. Like, November, we don't see a bird on there for Thanksgiving. You know what I mean? That's what I'm trying to say. Like, I like how it's not like that, because then when I want to, I can decorate my spreads when I want to, to be the holidays. So... I do like that. So Happy Planner's doing good. Um, and Keep Shining, and of course it has the, the unicorn. And then at the end, I don't think this came with anything. No, it just says take notes, take a note, and that's it. You get one note paper, which is fine, whatever. So that is this one, which was the vertical. I really like it. Bye, ladies. So, that was it for my goals. I only got those three things, which is the other one or the disc right here. Oh, do I look tan or is that red? That almost looks kind of red. I don't think I burned there. I think it's just how I have my hand. But So that was my goals. Next, get off of my paper, my pictures. Oh my gosh, okay. Next, I went to Joann's and I found a couple of great deals and I also used a couple of coupons. So for the coupon I had was 20% off when you first go onto their website and it says, oh, save 20% on sale items, give us your email. Well, I have an email for my YouTube channel, so I used that one, got the coupon, and it worked on the clearance items. 
which is awesome. The other two were not on sale. Michael still had Hypey Planner 30% off and Joann's didn't have them on sale, so I got these 50% off with two 50% off coupons. So, the first thing I got was the Happy Planner Washi. This was clearance, and the reason why I got it is I, I already have plenty of washi. I do not need any more washi, but I wanted to see how, ooh, no, come back to me. I wanted to see how Happy Scrappy, Happy Scrappy, really? The Happy Planner, I swear. Um, washi works. This is long. It doesn't say. It just says. It really doesn't say what planner it's for, but I feel like these are kind of long. So I guess unless it goes on the side, that would actually fit the big, not the classic. Here's a classic. So I don't know that is long. You guys see that kind of not really those are actually really really long fits all planners okay where I just want to use one just to be like where does this fit okay let's zoom all the way out so you guys can see this like maybe it fits all planners as in you have to cut it because as you guys can see the washi strip is way longer than the paper, but I guess they make it that long, so if you're using the big, it would fit it. Let's see, does it fit the big? We have the technology to find out. Yeah, actually it does. So it fits the big, so you can cut it to fit the classic. And you guys are looking ahead. Stop looking. We need to focus on the washi. Focus. Come come closer so you can focus on the washi. So it is pretty. And it came with these extra stickers, which I thought they were super cute. I love it. Love, love, love. I do not need any more stickers, you guys. But I made one more purchase, so Stay tuned. I got on the, I got bit by the happy planner bug for real. All right. So next is, uh, I heard someone say this wrong, grow, wrong, wrong, wrong. Oh, good Lord. Why do we even try? Anyways, it is the accessory book. I thought this was super cute. So the one I really want to get is a seasonal one. And I'm just like, oh. So they only have it online, it's the mini one, and I'm just like, I, I want to, but at the same time, I'm like, do I need it? No. This actually has some seasonal stuff in it. At least that page was. Flowers, look at all the coffee, macaroons, the girls, the dogs. I don't know when I would ever use the dogs. I love the girls and their groups. It's like, it's like me and my buds, okay? Just hanging out, looking all gorgeous. Look, getting fit. We got party, chilling, coffee dates. Yes to the beach. Super cute. And then of course you have the sticky notes here, and then the just list there. It's not a sticky. So that is this one. Next is the free spirit. Oh my gosh. So I first saw this with my friend, Emily, and then I was like, no, I'm not going to get it. I regretted it. Went back and got it. So here you have your checklist, some to do's, some more of these things, I guess are fancy labels. I guess we can call that, uh, what they're called. We have individual Different shapes for checklists. Some of these have numbers on here. Just really, oh, that's just so pretty. So pretty. I don't know what I'm gonna do with these big ones, but I'll make it work. The plan, get it done today. Remember to do some more of the pretty full boxes. I don't, I don't even know what the lingo is. I'm just going to call them full boxes because that's what I'm used to saying. 
It's just so pretty, you guys. So, so pretty. I love the dream catchers. We have this design. My stomach. You guys, I don't eat fast food, and my dumb butt decides, hey, let's get Wendy's on the way home. Hmm. Now my stomach is not happy. Go figure. The feathers, all this is it's just so pretty. So I'm glad I did pick this up because I had huge FOMO after not having it. And then living on a plan did a plan with me with using this. After I didn't get it, I was like, that's it. I'm going to go get it. So, you know, I just had to. I was just like, I saw that spread and I was just like, girl, it's so pretty. I have to go get it now. Story of my life. Okay. Next is this. So, I'm really excited because for memory keeping, what I wanted to do was a... I do love the fact it's not labeled. I love scrapbooking and I did, I was up to date on my scrapbooking before I started doing my whole planner. And well, I had a planner, but I wasn't doing stickers. Like I wasn't doing anything cute, no YouTube at that time. So I was on top of my scrapbooking. That was my arts and crafts thing. And that's what I did. Recently, since, what, January, February, when I started entering into the planner world and doing all that, I have yet to scrapbook, and it takes a lot of time to sit there from a blank, even if it's not a blank piece of paper, and I get the colored pretty paper, you're putting out the pictures, you're putting them on there a certain way, then you have the stickers to decorate it, blah, 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 and don't get me wrong. I enjoy it. I really, really do. However, I feel like this is so much easier and actually a little bit smaller. The ones that I've been getting were like the huge ones and then you put it all in there and it just gets big and bulky. This, I feel like, yes, it will get big over time and it, even though it is a big planner, it's still smaller than the scrapbook paper or the stuff I was used to because it's a 12 by 12. So anyways, I have this basically for when events and I are traveling or when we do something fun. Like I just printed these pictures out from my new HP. What is it called? Sparkit. 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 Whatever. Anywho, and I would just realize how perfectly they fit on here and the pictures came out so so cute and so that's what I think I'm gonna be doing so when we're out on our adventures and taking pictures on our phone and stuff like that I will be putting it on here now what I might not do I don't know yet if I'm gonna use the monthly it really depends because I don't know I haven't like I don't know yet and to be honest I don't have to use this as a monthly I could use this as a regular week the boxes are obviously smaller but when you're putting all your pictures together does it really matter you know what I mean so I might not use this as a monthly because say we don't we only do stuff that we take pictures and it was like two weekends out of the month. I don't want to waste it. So I rather just use this as a normal week. And then when I come over here, you just date it and you continue on the normal week. I think that's what I'm gonna do. And I mean, honestly, I might even cover up the days up here, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, like that, because most of the time, if we're working, and we do work, so we travel for our job. So if I, we're working during the week, there's not gonna be that many pictures. I might take pictures of our new place when we move into, you know, and stuff like that. But other than that, you're not really, I'm not really taking pictures during the week. It's only the weekend. So I might even wipe out everything or put a washi strip over it and just write the date over here and then just have that weekend and fill it with photos because even from my even from us tubing I have so many photos that I just I could just put all over this 
and then have it for that weekend. So I think that's what I'm going to do. I really like it. I have that little hole punch thingy that punches it into the squares. I think it's the squares for the classic. But I have plenty of stickers from my scrapbooking. And I also have plenty of stickers in general. <laughs> I also have beautiful paper too that I can cut up and put in here. So I'm really excited. That's what I'm how that's how I'm gonna use it. So I don't know how well I'm gonna keep up with this. Um unless it was something like we did like when we go to Montana probably the first two months until it starts to snow. Huh, we'll probably I'll probably be able to fill this out. If not, I can easily cover up the words with you know, either a whole piece of paper or something else and just put more photos there. So I'm not worried about it. We'll see how it is when it gets there. I was going to go ahead and show you guys what the dashboards look like for this one. Um, you and me, that's pretty. One happy life. This is not the one that I originally really fell for. I fell in love with the one that had the camera on top of it, over it. But it's $14 on clearance, plus an additional 20% off. So, yeah. i rather get this because I'm not really going to pay attention to the front or the dashboards, even though I'm showing them to you guys. Um, I'm really going to pay attention to more what's in the inside, so I'm not really worried about it. The camera one was super cute, though, just saying. But I'm not paying. Why well, pay $35? $34 when it's the same thing as on clearance. Unless it's something you really, 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 really was just like, oh my gosh, that is me. And oh my gosh, that speaks to my soul. And you know, girl, you do you. I've done that before. Trust me. So I feel like I have almost every single planner that the Happy Planner has to offer as far as like, I have a classic. I have a mini. I just ordered the micro to keep in the car. So as we're driving to our different assignments or anything, if I'm in in the car and I made an appointment, I can jot that down in there. Um, so I have a micro to keep in the car. And then now I have a big, which is a memory. So that's what I mean. I have like from all of, I have like something from all the sizes. I don't have every single planner and every single layout, of course, but you know. This is so pretty. So then at the end, it has, I thought this was really cool. All this different stuff that you can take out. So if there was a birthday, there's a couple of things here for a birthday and has a place for the dates. And it looks like it's both sides. This is big, the best day, all in one word. This would be good for fitness. Have a before and after, that's really cool. And then what was the other one? Auto memories, 30 days of gratitude, happy day, vacation. Oh, that's cool. Who, destination, favorite adventure, highlight, best memory. So that'd be cool. So for like, let's just say for Ireland, I could have this and then go into the whole weeks and do that. That would be cool. I actually might do that. Because I haven't scrapbooked Ireland yet it's been a month so i need to do that so yeah and then it just says start each day with a grateful heart and it looks like you can put pictures there as well so yeah i'm excited i love it i love seeing how what they were doing and how they still used you know like sayings and regular planner stickers with it it's really cool yeah. So that is everything from, yeah, Joann's. Okay. I'm going to show you guys real quick what I got from Target. It's a little less plannery, kind of. The first thing I got was this because I thought that a lot of um, my happy scrap, uh, scrap, oh my gosh, my happy planner. These, if they're not going to stick in my sticker book because they're kind of big, I thought it would, it, it would work that I would just throw them in there for right now and then I could flip through and organize them that way. 
and with any other papers like my leftover like when I'm have I have like one big planner with three different different planners in it so I would put the extra papers in here and stuff like that so that's what I got for that reason I love how it was like so shiny all right I did not need these no I did not but I picked them up anyways because I thought they were so pretty and Oh, who was it? I think it was Finn Plants. She was like, I, I took a picture and I was like, this is so pretty, but I don't need it. And she goes, oh, that would have been a beautiful dashboard. I'm like, girl, you're so right. So I went back to Target and I got it. So this one is like the hollow foiled and there's like rainbows or stars, there's shells, there's mermaids, there's unicorns, there's anchors. I mean, it's, it's, it's awesome. The next is like this beautiful mermaid tail with all this glitter happening. And this is what the back looks like. I was actually thinking of actually cutting them in half and putting it and hunch, punch holding them into my planner. So then I could use it for a pocket. Obviously this would be too big for the classic, a little bit big for the classic. It would fit perfectly in the big, but for the classic, you can always like trim it. This says spark, sparkle wherever you go. Oh my gosh, look at that. The, the two folders in the back is bigger than this one. That's hilarious. Okay, next I have a lot that I'm actually gonna be putting into a giveaway. Can you guys, can you guys see it? Ah! Okay, I had to scream because it's Lisa. It's Lisa Frank. Lisa freaking Frank. Okay, so yes, some of these are going into a giveaway. Now, I'm not gonna hoard them all because I don't need these many notebooks. So we have the leopard, and I'm trying to do this because there is like a texture of glitter. I don't know if you guys can see it. No. Probably not. So there is the leopard. We have the dog, the cat, and another dog. Again, the bottom, you feel it. You don't see it. It's okay. I'm going to quit trying. Next, of course, I'll be keeping this one. I think I picked up an extra one for the giveaway. It has the unicorns on it. Another dog. I got the dolphins, the cheetah, and some more dolphins. So some of these are going to be a surprise giveaway for sure. I just had to show you guys real quick because I was super excited. I was actually bummed out that I first didn't get the Lisa Frank ones and I cried and yeah, so now I have them. So I'm happy now and I get to put them in a giveaway. So, so yeah. I'm going to pop on everything. here real, real quick and show you guys what I got. It's, um, it's a little late. I think it's about 11 o'clock right now. A little late, you know. But I did go on joannes.com, <laughs> and um, yeah, I might have gotten some more things. So, what you guys just saw, which I'm hoping to add this part to the video that I just did of me putting this planner together, which is my first ever happy planner. I have the my budget planning in the beginning of the months, and then I kind of changed it a little bit. Right now I have this just jot it down in the middle so then before I do like like a monthly spread before I put down the stickers to really decorate it I could write down what's happening this month and then what I decided to do is take off that individual extra writing and put it at the end. So right now I have a couple months in here and then I have a divider that says keep um, stay happy keep smiling and on the side it says blah 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 and I have all my notes paper here some of it has the grid in the back some of it is just lines there's two different ones there's like a rainbow here on the side then I have this one that says um, just some thoughts and it's rainbow lines and then this one where it's get your study on came with this I think it came with a student one, I don't remember, and then um, important stuff. Then I have a folder in the back with some stickers, and then I'm like trying not to, I don't know why I'm making this difficult for myself. And then I have the post-it notes here, the divider labels, and then the, act the stickers that came with when I bought the planner was in like that box kit thing. So. As I was doing this and putting it together, 
I was like, I would like to have a planner to keep up with like social media because I want to do more posting. I want to organize more on my Instagram and stuff like that. So what I did was I went on Joann's because they were also having a sale. Michael's, Joann's, and Hobby Lobby were having like 30% off um, Happy Planner. But they had more selection at Joann's than Michael's did, at least for the online part. So I think this was like a newer, I want to say new, I don't know if this was new of a launch. This wrong, I don't even know. You guys, and my pronunciation, I don't even, I'm not even going to try because I know I'm going to butcher it. Anyways, a lot of this was sold out, so I don't, I don't know. So obviously I'm thinking it's new because this is newer from July to December. So, or I'm late. I'm picking this up because obviously we're already in July. So I got it in the month planner. What I liked about it, A, these girls are fabulous. Like absolutely fabulous. I wish I could look like that. And then the most important reason I got it is the layout is different. As far as the layout that I have right now happening. And just in case you didn't know what it looks like, because I'm still learning as well. So, let me turn this or hit the camera. You know, either or. It's fine. It's fine. So this is the unicorn one that I have right now that I put together on my extender rings. This is the one that I just purchased. So as you can see, this is the student one. So it's a little, it's a little different as far as the layout goes. Like this one doesn't talk about birthdays. It's just monthly goals, important dates, and it already has um, July 4th for Independence Day because this one starts in July. This one starts in August. Noted, and then remember this. And the student is just all the things, birthdays, important dates, some, what do you call it? like gratitude. And then it says going, wearing, excited for, reading, what makes you smile. So what I really liked about this monthly layout, this, not this, but I'm going to just, I guess I should just go in order. So... As you can see, it's basically the same. On the side here, this one just says notes. The student one says monthly goals, to-do list, and then did you know kind of thing, which is cool. I put the sticker on when I did. Well, you guys know. You just saw. Ha, ha, ha. I forgot. Like I was going to try to put this together as one and not keep this video separate from the other video that I already did. Okay. So this is what the student one looks like as far as the vertical. So it has like, don't forget, upcoming tests, and I'm feeling, and then weekend adventures. What I thought this would be cool as far as um, social media goes, you have a, where it says July, it says errands to buy, calls and emails, bills to pay, focus. And I like how the weeks are right here. So you have a tracker right here. Like a habit tracker or, ha or schedule, whatever you want. It says Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday through Sunday. And then your Monday, Tuesday through Sunday here. I like this because then I can look overall. What do I need to do? So say I want to take a picture and have everything ready for a post that I'm going to do here. Or vice versa or whatever. I like this. I like this layout. Now as far as it being my... We want to call it my daily. No. No. <laughs> I like having my stickers tell what I did that week. And this wouldn't be enough space. So for a social media, I like it. Now I'm debating. Because you see how these all go together. I'm debating whether or not I want to put this in that my student planner. Or keep this separate. Like, keep social media separate from my personal life, basically. I don't know how to explain it, but that's what I'm thinking because I'll show you an old spread of mine. So this is my Erin Condren. This is what my weekly spreads 
normally look like. You know, it's it's pretty full, it's pretty wild, and I personally love it and enjoy it. Look at that. And that's what I was worried about. I don't want to give this up. Like, this is so much fun, and I have so many kits, you guys, that I can't, I would hate to not use. So, I definitely want to keep doing it this way, where I can use the little emojis that tells my story and what I did and stuff like that. Like, they're all so cute, and I love them, love them to death, and they make me happy. So, I'm, I'm hoping this one will work out. I, th I still think this is too narrow for some of the sticker kits that I have, this box. But I know there's another layout that's vertical that I think it's a little bit thicker. And it, it looks like the Erin Condren as far as having... Let me show you on um, the three boxes where there's one that's similar to that. So we shall see. I really don't want to buy <laughs> another planner as far as that so I'm gonna see how this works and if it really doesn't work out then I'll de debate on whether or not I'm gonna buy another happy planner that's vertical to make those stickers work because so far in my Erin Condren I'm good until what was it December of this year so I guess still be trying you know doing both on here and look how big the difference is so this is a classic, and this is the extender. Oh my gosh. Oh, and then look, 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 look. Look at this. Look at this. Ah! Isn't that the cutest thing? I mean, look how tiny it is. And then look how tiny the rings are. Oh my gosh. Isn't that the cutest? It's so cute. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to move these other planners out of the way. So this is a monthly planner as well. And isn't this a small, the mini? I think it's the mini. Because then they, no, 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 the mini's smaller than this. Crap. I forgot the size name of this. No, this is a mini Happy Planner. Okay, so maybe I was, there was one that I could have sworn that was, oh, that might be the micro. That's what I'm thinking. So for this, what I was originally going to do was, um, keep it in the car and keep it with me so if I needed to if I have some important things that are happening that I already have scheduled I could add this to it to it on here um I also bought these awesome dividers because I wanted to add plain paper so as we're driving around and traveling if I wanted to write something down I can so what I might do is put these I have the classic metal ones to put on here so instead of it being this size it's going to be this size and even though that looks big oh you can't even see I'm not even showing you so I'm gonna make these rings into this size but in the metal ones and even though that looks big I kind of don't want to take this one too much of a part I just want to add these to it and then call it quits. So hopefully these can hold up to having all this plus this and like one divider or two. I might be able to divide it up, but I think it might be able to. I think so. I think so. So I'm not going to do that tonight as far as putting it all in. I'll just show you guys real quick how cute this is. Oh my gosh. Like shine on and. August go with the flow they also had at least at my Joann's they had a couple of happy planners that were the big ones I was going on clearance like they had like the baby one oh that's, that's pretty so I'm not pregnant so I don't need that one but anyways it's super cute I I love it I don't know if I showed you guys the top it says do not stop believing. Look how cute is that. I love the donuts. I just think it's so cute. And I love these colors, but I don't want to keep the plastic. I think the metal will be more sturdier. I guess I want to say, especially if I want to be throwing it in my purse or leaving it in the car and stuff like that. So, yeah. 
that was my quick little haul that I wanted to pop up in here and show you guys because as I'm editing, I'm sure I'm going to want to take apart and look through it and stuff like that. But I really wanted to show you guys first on how it is. And this one is just so sleek and so pretty. I don't think I flipped through a lot of it. There's fashion girls everywhere. Like, it's just so pretty. It really is. So, I'm excited to try this out. You know, like, you never know. I love how I can make it my own planner and move. I like how customizable it can be, how there's so many different layouts that you can make it and everything. I have more stuff coming that I ordered. And um, I'm hoping to build my perfect planner. And I'm excited to show you guys once I start laying down my stickers how it will work and stuff like that. And that would be the true test on... Can I, can I switch? Can I switch from the Erin Condren to the Happy Planner? Or maybe I need it both. I hope not. I feel like it's, I feel like that would be like too much for me, but you know what I'm trying to say? So hopefully this is educational. I don't know how much education I can give you because I am so new to the planner community and then on top of that, so new to Happy Planner. But this will be cool for you guys to see how I'm going to put together my planners and what I come across of. Just in case if you guys are curious about the Happy Planner or the Erin Condren, you know. So, we'll see. So, I'm super excited. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, please give this video a thumbs up. I hope you guys have a great day or night, whatever time you guys are watching this. And please follow me on Instagram because I'll be taking a lot of pictures and updating you guys on my planner there as well. It's also plan.live.travel. And then on my home screen thing on YouTube, there's a link that will take you directly there, which is cool. So, yeah, you guys have a great night. I'm going to shut all these lights down and finish editing and then go to bed and then work. Yay for Monday. Yeah, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!